check it out and make this quick as possible. But I see a lot of people wasting money on their bills, man. I just want to get on here and try to, like, help everybody since it's so expensive, bro. Like, it costs a lot, dog. So I'm just go through here and make a point guard real quick. I'll try to make a couple positions, whatever. To just show, like, the points and stuff. So, like, what I've been noticing people doing on a lot of bills is stuff like this. Nah, if you're in the comments, you probably can see what's wrong with this. Right here. And we'll go straight to the badges. People putting, like, okay, say, forget it. I'm going to just go. I'm going to go 84 dunks so I can get the packages, right? Bet. Then they go do this. Right here. Yeah, bro, you got the contacts for the pros, but you don't have the, the one hands. You don't got the off one foot. You only got the two hands, the the two, the off two feet one hand, whatever. You don't have all the, the pro dunk contacts. You got to put your vert to 75, bro, to get that. And then you waste the points because it's like if you're going to slash, bro, to touch these badges, you need at least 18. That's for every category. For every category for these core badges, you need 18 badges minimum, bro, to even touch that. I got a bill right now where I got 14, and I can get bronze poster, and I'm going to just basically core that and then go from there. So, as you can see, it's only five points, but that'll save me five points on that bill. But that's a bill that I made that I feel like I messed up on, kind of, because I put too much into my perimeter defense, which took away, especially when you got guards. So, like, 85, you see I got silver poster just now. That's an extra point that people waste because they don't they don't look for the badges. They just want the animation. The badges mean more, bro. 86, that got me gold takeoff. After that, you don't get nothing else until, I think like, yeah, 92. 92 or 93. 93 is gold post. Too much attack. That's too much. So we go 86, right? Okay, for your layups. Of course, you're not going to dunk the ball every time. John Slayer Hall of Fame, perfect. Need that. That's why you go get an 80, 80 pack, 80 uh, layup package. Save points. Take away until you don't need. See what I'm saying? You can take away. 86. That put me right at 41 standard dunk. Instead of having a 44 dunk, and I'm wondering after I make my bill, like, dang, where my points at, bro? Like, I'm missing points. I got to finesse. Bro, just take that away. Make sure all your points are you being used like efficiently bro instead of the wrong way i see a lot of people look at these youtube bills and they wonder why they can't make anything 85 3 silver limitless if you go up to 92 you get gold that's for every bill but it is agent three it's the badge that pop on all the time 89 3 for me. and you get blinders and corn specials if that's what you do like this is the little stuff people miss out on mini magician Get on gold, you only need a 73. To get all the fame, 81. Passing, 79. I see a lot of people come out here with bad passing, bro. You, you putting everybody at a disadvantage when you got a 60 pass and you throwing ducks out there and everybody's stealing the ball from you, bro. Like, you, know, I'm not saying you got to go to 80, but at least make your passing decent. Like, even 70 is still bad in my opinion, but 70 is whatever. Like, if you can work with that, cool. But I go 80. I just want gold diamond. That's it. Get Hall of Fame, you need a little higher than that, 85. So my point guard got 85, but I don't think everybody should have that much passing if that's not what they're doing. Hall of Fame, quick first step. Badge that's needed. All you need is an 89 ball handle. So this 6'8 dude only got an 80 speed ball. Of course, I'm going to be slow a little bit with the dribble, this and that. But at the end of the day, when I catch it and use that quick first step, I'm gone. Like, that's beneficial. Perimeter D. I see a lot of people go do this. But they prune to do the 88, but you don't need that, bro. You don't need that at all. 85 gets you pick dodger gold. 86 gets you challenger on gold and workhorse, ankle braces. 87 gets you Hall of Fame minutes. That That's what I go for. I want them badges to drop. 92 gets you clamps on gold. You ain't got to go that high if you don't want to. Like, just save yourself points, bro. Steel. If you just want a bronze glove, bronze, what you call it? All you got to do is 64. That's it. Check your badges before you move your points. And make sure your points, like, not being taxed, bro. Like, so it's a lot of people that just leave points randomly. Go for what you want. Rebound chase 70. That's all you need. 
gold box 82 like stuff like that i see people go 88 board like bro you don't need that bro you're not getting nothing for having that all you need is 85 for silver that's it and then you can bring this down and that save you more for blocks now you can get a 70 block 77 76 75 get you gold chase down i see a lot of people doing this like and they be taxing they bill bad So I can show like a build that I made a lot. Um, I can show you like how you can manipulate these points to where you can make an all-around player. Like I literally made an all-around player. Like this is about probably my most all-around build. Let's see, put my dribbles to 90. Look at that. They want me to go 91. I only need 90. 90 gonna give me most of the dribble packages. I can't get the 92s, but I can get the 90s. Speed ball need that. I don't need an 80 pass accuracy. I've been playing the game long enough to know. Perimeter defense, you really only need like an 80. But for this dude, I went 87. Steals, uh, I'm going to play with that real quick. Defense and rebound, I made a lock, so I want to grab boards. Blocks, I went to 60. Just saving points. Notice how I'm saving points. I only got the minimum. The minimum needed for what I want. Let's go 85 on my steals. Because all I want is that glove on silver. That's it. That's all I need. I only want 82 on this so I can box out with gold. That's it. And it's just for like if I'm playing in the park or something like that. Let's see. Bird, 75 minimum. That's all I need for all the dark patches I want. Stamina, 90. Um, like stuff like that. I feel like people sell their bills out a little too much. I don't remember how I got my shrimp up so high. Let's see. I did something weird. Here we go. Okay, so now I got bronze bully. I just manipulated my point. So now I can like use this last point on something and try to steal one. So look, I got another bad for that. So 14, 18, 23, 17. So I'm about to hit level 40, so I'll just put that extra defensive badge on 18. But once I make the player, I'll just put my plus four that I got from my career on my slash, and that way I can touch every one of my categories to get a core badge. You see what I'm saying? Like, that's what's messing everybody up, these core badges. I see a lot of bills on YouTube from these big YouTubers having y'all, oh, yeah, I got this dude with 93 dunk. Bro, you only got 12 slashing badges, bro. Like, you're not going to be able to do nothing with that because you're not going to be able to touch it ever. Like, you have to play multiple seasons to even get to 18 badges, bro. Like, you just, you just really played yourself. But this is just something I wanted to do. I just wanted to drop some so everybody can see, like, the manipulation of these points. Like, pay attention to how many you put in each category. I know you want to have a 90 defense, a 90 perimeter, and all that. But what's the point if you're not getting a badge for it or gaining any badges for it? You can put that somewhere else. That's it. So you can get other stuff. But that's my video. Um, I just wanted to drop this because... VC outrageous, bro. It's outrageous. So, like I said, I'm going to do a giveaway around Christmas time. At least two people going to get some VC out of me. And I'll make sure it's at least $50 worth of VC. So, at least 200 k So, I'm going to make sure I do that. So, y'all just drop a like, sub, do all that, comment, whatever. Keep in touch with me. You can add me on PlayStation. I don't mind. We always looking for people to run. But I appreciate y'all. I'm just, I'm on the road to 1000 right now. So if you stop through, just drop a comment. Let me know, bro. Appreciate y'all. Right, let's go on the test. We're going to check this out real quick. I just want to make sure I at least show what I'm talking about with these badges. 14, right? No, just go 10. All right, because you need 10 minimum to even touch. Look at that. I already lost stuff, so let me go feel this here. Can't do nothing, bro. that can't do that